Good morning, everybody. It is 7.51, April 26th. God bless each and every one of you. I hope and pray that everybody receives a message from this. And uh, I want to just go over this real quickly, try to keep it short if I can. This evening, the study that we're going to be going on is uh, about faith, okay? And hopefully we can get through this in a fairly decent amount of time. And then... Uh, we're going to be studying where it says fake news. Fake news. And you wonder, well, what has fake news got to do with the Word of God? Well, let's watch and you'll see. We're going to be pulling up scriptures. And a lot of these scriptures, nobody even knows about them. Why? Because they're not studying the Word of God. But you guys, we're going to be uh, timing people out. that are not going to be there uh paying attention to these studies when we see people distracting other people because i don't know who's who but if you're not staying focused on the studies you're going to get timed out probably a few times and if it can continues happening because see the enemy you guys we're in spiritual warfare right now so if you're not here to be among us but to be separate and to be focused on other things other than what we're trying to study about I'm going to have to block you. You'll be timed out a couple of times. But then eventually you're just going to be blocked where you'll no longer be able to make any more comments. And I'm sorry to have to say this, but this is what's going to have to happen. Because we're in a spiritual war right now and we're here to strengthen ourselves in the Word of God. Okay? And uh, so let's stay focused. And I want to say this. If you can just stay focused through the timing that we're going to be doing... And understanding what's going on, when I'm through, we'll have an hour, hour and a half, I don't know, quite a while. If it's a good topic and everybody's really uh, getting into it, we're going to be, you will have time to have different conversations and things. But while I'm reading and going over these things, I put these together so we can continue and get stronger in the Word of God. But if people are going to be doing other things, trying to distract what I'm putting together, you guys, I'm going to have to, I'll be timing you out, timing you out, and eventually blocking if this continues, okay? And I'm giving everybody a heads up here. It's not going to be me doing it by myself. There's many people out there that's got a wrench. There's a reason why they've got that wrench. They're going to be learning what it is to time people out. And then they're going to be learning how they're getting tired of timing people out. When they get tired of timing you out, they're going to be blocking you. And then uh, you'll no longer be able to make comments. But you will be able to watch the studies. You just won't be able to participate in after the study comments. Because that's going to be for those that are in the body of Christ together. Okay, Not saying that. You know, y'all aren't, but some people are being distracted. They're being led away. See, and I've read about that too as well, where many will be led away, you know, with just led away, you know. Don't let people distract you, man. And uh, one person I've warned many times about this because every time he comes on, that's all he talks about is, demonic demons around him constantly listen you guys we're in spiritual darkness right now it says woe to the inhabitants of the earth these things are here now okay but my focus is in the word of god not on them okay i know they're around but when i'm putting studies together and i'm trying to get people to understand and learn scriptures and you're there distracting it you're going to get timed out a couple of times to where you won't be able to interrupt it anymore. Then eventually people are going to get tired of timing you out and they're going to be blocking. <clears throat> now, this is why a lot of you have wrenches. Please feel free to use them when you see these things happening, okay? God bless you guys. I love you all. In the name of our Lord and our Savior, Jesus Christ.